Hey kindergartners, it's Mrs. Fitzpatrick. I am so excited to see your smiling faces tomorrow. I know that the night before kindergarten can be a little bit scary and you might feel a little bit nervous. So I thought, hmm, what do I do when I feel nervous? Well, I like to read. So I thought that I would read a story to you to help you get to sleep, calm your nerves and get excited for kindergarten tomorrow. So the book that I'm gonna read to you is called The Night Before Kindergarten. Twas the night before kindergarten, and as they prepared, kids were excited and a little bit scared. They tossed and they turned about in their beds while visions of school supplies danced in their heads. Erasers and crayons and pencils galore were stuffed in their backpacks and set by the door. Outfits were hung in the closets with care, knowing that kindergarten soon would be there. In the morning it came, school starts today. Would the teacher be nice? Would they still get to play? Faces were washed and teeth were brushed white. Kids posed for pictures with eyes sparkling bright. Parents packed snacks and kids hopped in cars as if they were boarding a spaceship to Mars. Some kids brought blankets or their favorite stuffed bear in hopes they could nap like they did in daycare. Their parents exclaimed, you're big kids, wow! Let us hold your bears and blankies for now. The parents were worried their children would cry if they left them at school with just a goodbye. So they told their darlings, if you want, we can stay and make sure that everything will be a-okay. The teacher then greeted each one with a smile and invited the students to stay for a while. The room was all filled with toys, books, and maps, but where were the beds for mid-morning naps? They colored and painted and played Simon Says, then tumbled and skipped and stood on their heads. They sang silly songs from beginning to end. Within just a minute, each kid had a friend. The children were happy they loved Miss Sunrise. It was she who was in for a giant surprise. When what to her wondering eyes should appear but sad moms and dads who were holding back tears. Their noses so stiffy, their eyes red and wet. This was the saddest goodbye Miss Sunrise had seen yet. She gathered the grown-ups on the magical rug, then sent them away after one final hug. The children all waved from the door of the school. Don't cry, Mom and Dad. Kindergarten is cool. And just like that, when you wake up tomorrow, our journey will begin as kindergartners. I am so excited to start our journey together, and I can't wait to see you tomorrow. Get a good night's sleep. Bye-bye.